Interesting song choice. Thank you, DJ. No matter where I go, man, they always play rap music. DJ always comes up backstage, what do you want to play, Gary? I was like, I don't care. And he just assumes I want rap music. I will say this about music, though. I've noticed over the last few years, uh, there's a huge difference between black guys and white guys when it comes to music. Like, like when a black guy's jam comes on, I mean, his jam. I don't give a fuck where he's at. Starbucks, Chipotle. Black guy's always gonna be lead singer, his jam. He's always gonna be lead singer. He ain't gonna be Maze. He gonna be Frankie Beverly when his comes on the radio. I ain't never seen no brother imitate Maze, you know? White guys, we're not like that. When our jam comes on, we don't give a fuck about the words. We wanna play instruments. Oh, f yeah! Boom, guitar! You ain't never seen no brother just bust out a keyboard in middle of a nightclub. Oh, Cause all of me loves all. What's up, baby? But, uh, <laughs> I love being a comedian, though. Oh, I don't know, though. Last, um, last year or so, it's been a little, little tough on comics. You know, Bill Cosby's not having the best time right now. <laughs> Does any of his hoes die? I have never seen so many old women with vivid memories in my life. For not remembering shit, they don't forget shit. <laughs> One girl said, yeah, Bill Cosby touched me in 1962. I'm like, hold the fuck up, 54 years ago? That don't count no more, that don't count no more. That's called a life lesson, learn from it. That's before Selma. I can't come after somebody for some shit to happen before Selma. Selma's got to be the cutoff. I actually went to that march. I went to that march. I went to the 50 year march at Selma. I went in and I just wanted to see what it was all about. Um, it's crazy. I, I had never been to Selma before. And I was like, um, they could have built this up a little bit. They knew it was coming. Shit. They didn't have a Starbucks in that bitch. <laughs> So this, this the town? This it? Cause you see it on the news, you think it's gonna be something. Very Walking Dead-like. I was waiting for Rick to pop up. Carl! <laughs> and I stayed in Selma. Like I got a hotel room in Selma, right? I got there the night before and I got there. And so I, I got there like six o'clock. I had my night free. So I went to the front desk dude at the hotel. I said, hey man, this is my first time in Selma. What's the do around here? He was like, you're doing it. <laughs>